Next, I'd like to give an update on the COVID-19 situation in Sheboygan County. Uh, the numbers for today show that um, we have 1,160 active cases overall. That's up 75 from last week. Um, we have 98 active cases. That's down nine from last week. Uh, we have 1,052 cases that have recovered, and that's up 83 from the previous week. And at this time, we have eight individuals in the hospital, and that's up two from last week. And unfortunately, we had one additional death, so we've gone from nine deaths previously to 10 deaths this week. And uh, overall, we've had 30,042 uh, negative tests, and that's up 1,672 from last week. The Sheboygan County Health officials released a safe uh, start recommendation plan to reopen and included strong controls for businesses and residents, and we continue to be in phase two of that plan that says that businesses need to follow the Wisconsin Economic Development Corporation's best practices and sanctions for their specific uh, type of business. The Mead Library and other city buildings have instituted mandatory mask policies to enter the public areas of city buildings. Masks are provided if needed. And then recently, Governor Evers declared a public health emergency and signed emergency order number one relating to preventing the spread of COVID-19 and required the wearing of masks in indoor and outdoor public spaces where people congregate. Sheboygan County law enforcement agencies, including the police department, will utilize this order as an educational tool as they're asking citizens and visitors of Sheboygan County to voluntarily comply with the order. Remember to wear your mask and slow the spread of the coronavirus in Sheboygan. Join the Mask Up Sheboygan campaign.